not much going on. So far it's a so far it's a dud, but it's only 6 a.m. We got a long way to go. Boston Trucker here. Welcome to my channel. I hope you enjoy it. things I carry with me when I'm out plowing emergency supplies big bag of popcorn I don't drink coffee but I like my diet Pepsi I got a can of diet Pepsi I got a bunch of waters I got some granola bars I got three peanut butter and jelly sandwiches and a steak and onion sub under that I got any kind of medicines I might need if I don't feel well. What else? I got some uh, Snyder pretzels for my road trip. And uh, I got some Dayquil in a water bottle. Got your phone, got charges, got a winter hat, gloves. I got my pillow. I don't think I'm going to have a time to take a nap, but you never know. My high vis jacket and the Boston trucker. <laughs> That's it. Artists are already seeing numbers like four or five inches, six inches near Brockton, three, four or five inches around the city already. And with this wind and these cold temperatures, the Boston Logan temperature 24, low 20s north and west, and those actually may come down a bit. So this is that very the dry, slippery snow that's just going to blow around. It's going to be hard to measure, to be honest. But what it is going to create is drifts as we go through the day with one to two feet, well, two feet of snow, as much as three feet around greater Boston, lesser amounts off to the north and west as you taper down to the foot or two. But in and around the city, we can see in near suburbs drifts that could cover the first story up to the second story of some buildings and buried cars. 
Uh, also, keep an eye on this coastal flooding situation at times of high tide, especially from the city down along the north shore of the Cape here, especially uh, over the next few high tide cycles. All that more will be covered in the storm coverage as we watch this blizzard unfold in front of us. Jeff, right here on WBZ Boston's News Radio. Well, it's almost 7 a.m. We just made our first pass. They're saying south of us, they got many inches so far. We've only got about maybe a half an inch. But it's common, they're saying we're going to get a couple inches per hour, so... We're ready for it. What's up, Manny? How you doing? How you doing? Bad. Good. What's up? What's up, Teddy? The pin fall out? No, the pin didn't fall out, but I want to see if the flashlight's on my truck. Hold yeah. on. warning 18 to 24 inches maybe 30 inches now the blizzard of 1978 we had 27.1 they're saying we're gonna break it but I don't know it's just kind of blowing around it's 8 a.m. it's really not doing much they say other places of the state they're getting nailed but we're just kind of sitting here waiting for something to do we went around a few times scraped but just kind of wasting fuel you know, wasting fuel and looking stupid. So we're gonna sit out a little while and uh, wait it out, wait for something to happen. There's a cool old machine right here. Trojan, it's got a Detroit under the, under the hood here. You should hear this thing going down the road. Low, 
visibility right now at times, depending on which way the wind's blowing. Definitely ramping up here. Windows are icing up. Blizzard-like condition out in pockets of the South Shore. In fact, a report from Duxbury, a peak gust of 62 miles per hour. This is already the beginning. And the snow will be falling at the rate of 2 inches per hour at times. Is this something I can hit the other one with? Yeah, the can. I just happen to find this after I grabbed it. Okay. Now we got a snowstorm. Alright, whatever I said before, you can ignore it. It's coming down hard and it's coming down fast. It's, it is accumulating. Well, I'd say we probably got four inches already now. It's only 11.15 uh, a.m. Got a long way to go. I gotta be honest, I don't know if it's coming through on the video, but there's times where I can't even see. Crossing in front of Waltham High School here. So my son goes to school, he's a sophomore. I won't say his name because I don't want to embarrass him. He's a good kid. Just turned 16. Right now it's white up. Better get some fuel. What's up, buddy? Hi. 6 p.m. Fueling up the trucks. Gonna head back out. How we doing, buddy? You're on YouTube. We got a little bit of snow. Yep. 
I had to get my car out and the truck in here. I had to walk through it. Now that's a video. Michael Cardillo, ladies and gentlemen, in the Ford pickup truck. It's gonna plow me a path. <coughs> we are done. It is now 1 a.m. Well, we got it parked. That was 23 hours out. About 14 inches of snow or so. It's Sunday morning. Going home for a little while. Get some sleep. Shovel out the driveway. And then I think we're hauling snow in the big trucks. So this video might have to be a two-parter. If you enjoyed this video, hit that subscribe button, share it with a friend on social media, tell a friend. Thanks for watching as always, it means a lot to me. Comment down below, hit that like button, or hit that unlike button. I don't really care about that. And uh, Boston Trucker, enjoy your Sunday. I'm gonna go home and go to bed. Out.